Hey guys, welcome back for some more monkey business. Uh, so today I got a little bit something different for you. I found myself, we've we done one simulator already. Um, I found myself, I've been playing a lot of it off, you know, offline by myself, just kind of getting used to the game. Um, and I'm definitely going to have more of that come for you guys. Um, I got a, some DLC that, that I purchased for it and I've upgraded my stuff a little bit and, uh, get some good you know working for you guys there but uh browsing through steam i found myself finding gunsmith simulator which is you know big fan of just pulling guns apart and just the idea of it so i started and uh this here is a the you can see it's a colt 1911 on the this is the first gun that you actually pull apart for your grandfather as the storyline goes um i did that mission just to kind of get used to see how it works interface wise um real cool love it um so um we're gonna we're gonna see whether or not this gets monetized because i forgot to turn off the um the music so we're gonna get right on into it actually let's um, we're gonna try it. We're gonna do it now, just cause uh, if there is any issues, I could try to uh, mute the game audio or whatever up until about this point. So, um, yeah, I'll just go back and edit it in. It's all right. It's fine. Um just don't want to be copyright stricken or whatever so uh yeah let's let's continue it all in here you guys uh you, you did miss out me tearing apart a, a colt 1911 i guarantee you we're gonna do plenty of those because this is one of my favorites um asher what are you doing ash what are you doing, boy? Sorry, folks. My son's playing with stuff in my room. Um, but yeah, so um, I've already gotten uh, a couple of guns here, I'm ready to go. Um, we are definitely gonna do this. Um, I feel like, it, as any gun collector, you gotta have one of these. I don't it's trademark gun you you just got to so this one we're going to do a repair um i think it's just a trigger uh it's not my fault and i don't know what happened but i cannot shoot with my gun um yeah the trigger is all messed up you can see it you can you can even see it there it's kind of just stuck back um, but yeah, so we got to repair this. It's cool. It gives you little stats on the, the, the gun itself, but, uh, yeah, we're going to, we're going to get in here. Hold on. I'm going to adjust this for a minute. So yeah, you get to walk around with it, you know, it's really nice and cool. Um, if my movements are kind of weird, hold on, let's see. Yeah. If I slow it down a little bit. All right. Um, Again, I gotta. I, I'm still working on trying to update, upgrade my uh, my uh, PC, so that way things are a little bit smoother for you guys. But um, we'll get there. Look at all the stuff we get to change on this thing. Ugh! Look at all that. Oh my goodness. Whew! I hope we got enough money for this thing. Um. So the, if I mess up on some things, it's mostly probably because um, we're going to put this down. It's I, f I find it to be easier to do without exploded mode. Putting together f exploded mode is way easier, but taking it apart is kind of um, harder because you can't really um, maneuver this thing around. Um, yeah, we're going to take that off. Uh, so 
So I am like in like just like in you know mechanic simulator. I am what is the uh hold on. I am not a uh I don't have experience in the with this in the real world. So um this is uh not my area of expertise. So if I'm kind of stumbling around trying to figure out uh hold on. Okay. There we go. We can grab and rotate this. Okay, we're gonna take this off. Boom. Oh, we're gonna take that out. Uh it does this weird thing where it like um like I said I'm still getting used to how this game functions um uh, and there's a whole like uh like you can go shoot these things and maneuver them around and stuff so yeah this is what I'm looking for right here didn't make sense to pull it off without actually like all right so then we got here what is the gotta take the muzzle part off Ooh, hold on hold on Ugh, I don't like how it zooms in like that but uh, there it goes take this off uh, yeah, you can take off everything. Barrel. Uh, I think everything is off of here. Hold on. There's a piece. Uh, uh, nope, I think everything's off. I think, yeah, what it is is something over here. What? Uh. Yeah, I think everything's out. Cool. Receiver, you got these things. Take that off, and then this part you gotta take. Boom, you gotta take, uh, hold on, Oy, I think it's a different part that I'm looking at, yep, right here, boom, I do, I, I, I don't quite like how it, it jumps you right into, uh, okay, that's that piece there. Then what is uh I don't know. Uh I think it's missing some pieces now I'm looking at it. Sometimes these things they they'll be like missing pieces and zoom in really really close on things here take that that piece goes there uh, this piece comes out and that piece goes there does not look like that piece is going to be coming out. Uh, so I guess there are just missing pieces 
broad spring the bolt no uh, hold on Yeah, there's a lot of this that's not allowing me to... So I'm assuming that if, if it's not letting me disassemble something, I probably don't have the ability to yet. Um, yeah, I might be just missing a bunch of pieces. That's probably what that what's happening here. Left follower plate uh, 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 <clears throat> oh yeah there we go hold on we're gonna take this apart so I guess I don't necessarily have to uh yeah, uh, broken. Is that missing pieces? Uh, broken pieces. Dirty. Uh, okay. Leave table. And we're just going to come over here to uh, clean parts. So the receiver and the stock are dirty. And you take this. Right, and then it shows you these parts here, and you just shine them up good. Well, it's kind of like a it's it's an approximation type thing. They don't make you try to get every nook and cranny of the dang thing. So, uh, yeah. So. Get it all nice. There it goes. Boom. Two pieces. All done. And now we come over here to the table. And we got all kinds of stuff. Okay. This is our list of shopping stuff here. All right. We are going to go with uh, rifles. Uh, we're going to go with uh, M1. Yeah. Grand. Just in case. Boom. All right. So we need a barrel. Hold on. Whoops. I need a, a barrel. Uh left follower rod plate. <laughs> uh Left follow follower rod plate. Boom. You know, operating rod spring. Uh, operating catch rod. Operating rod spring. There we go. This thing. Boom. Trigger housing. Um. Don't see any trigger housing. Again, I'll, I'll probably get faster and faster at looking at a part and knowing what I'm looking at. Um, but yeah, I don't have trigger 
Guard, hammer housing, trigger housing, right here. Trigger housing, and then the trigger. Um, yeah, that looks good to go. Come up here. Uh, buy. Okay. Got it, right? And then it comes all the way over here. And look at all this, look at this box. Box of goodness. Come over here. Right? And this is all of our box, our pieces, right? Boom. Uh, can I just do, yep, okay. Uh, and, okay. Now, some of these pieces now need to be oiled, right? So these are one of those pieces that just pick it up and it'll do it. Boom. Real quick. So it's like, these are processes that if you ever have actually experience doing this type of stuff. And like I said, I don't really have experience doing this type of stuff, but I, I do have an understanding of that. This job takes way longer, and time-consuming, all that stuff. Now, this is where Exploded comes in. Because now, we're going to come down here, and we're going to... Can we... I want to... Okay. Um, this is where I think this, this works way better. Because it's the uh, boom. I don't have to worry about orienting myself. Slam this whole thing together. Look at that right in there. Put the trigger in. Put the pin. Okay. Uh, this can just go on. This can just go on. Uh, that in. Hold on. Ugh. Okay. Um. Put this here. Here. Put that in. These go here. And here. Okay, this goes here. Alright, now I guess we're going to just start. That goes there. Okay. Boom. Okay. This goes on here. Oh, we're going to put that there. That. Uh, this is insanely satisfying. Just this whole. Uh, this whole setup going. Put that there. This goes here. There. We put this, okay. Boom, okay. This goes here, and this goes in here. Oh, there we go. Reassembled. Finish work. Take your gun. Uh, we can go. Let's go. Uh, I haven't done this yet. Let's take this, uh, so I figured out, I thought 
you know, probably put it in the box, put it in the truck would have been the nice way. So put it, you either put it in the truck and take it, or the fucking station wagon? I don't know. I'm going to call it a truck for now. Um, oh, into your truck. Uh, if you put it in the truck, you go to the shooting range. If you put it in the back of the box, you complete the order so you don't get to go test, test drive it. Yeah, put it in there. Boom. Nice little lockbox. What? Uh. Uh, leave. Okay. Get in, and we're gonna go to the... We're gonna go shooting range. We're just gonna go test it out. Just to make sure that it fires and everything, and... Uh, you got an M1 Garant. We're gonna go shoot the thing. I probably wouldn't actually do this with a customer's, you know, gun. But, uh, uh, if you bring more guns, you can select them with one, two, and three. Okay. Okay, alright. And cycle, select, fire, exit, tutorial, finish. Okay, well, we're gonna... I just want I just want to be I just want to shoot targets um Oh Jesus How do I Uh, do I not? Okay. Self-explanatory. Uh, I guess. Sharpshooter. That's not bad. Iron sights, though. Wait, wait. Let's see. We gotta see. Oh, God. Satisfying. They even did the thing. Guys, they did the thing. Ugh. It literally, literally the most satisfying part. Like, this gun was so accurate. So such a hall like staple for the United States military back in World War I, history buffs are going to kill me too I believe uh World War 1 World War 2 I don't know but I I I got to read up on like history but uh um unpack gun cool um such a great gun um, but the most satisfying part about it was ejecting the, 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 um, the mag or whatever.
that pinging sound. Ugh, it's the most satisfying ever. Nice. Proficient. Parts budget. Cool. Alright, we're gonna check, check time real quick. 25. That's that's long enough for one video. Uh, I didn't. I don't want to. I gotta start limiting how long my videos are. It's really killing my computer here. Um, send back the play using. Okay, um, we're gonna send it back. But uh, uh, what is this? Services. Your new job is on our radar. Uh, shooting at its finest. Uh, you can check it in the car. Um, broken Glock, huh? A car ninety eight. All right, accept this. Uh, browse jobs. Let me see if I can. Hell yeah, cool. Uh, have four contacts at the same time. Cool. Um, yeah, look at all that. Different guns. Car 98. We got a Mauser 96, QBZ 97, and then just got that Glock with the car. Yeah. So um. But yeah, got to limit the amount of time that I'm spending in these videos. So uh, if you like the video, you know, like this kind of content, like, subscribe, uh, hit the notification bell. So that way you can get alerted to more content. Uh, leave a comment. You know, don't got to say much. Just say hey. Uh, you know, if you want to start a conversation in there, go ahead. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys next time. All right. Later.